Hi, my name is Chris Dickinson and I'm a life cycle engineer here at Laser Quantum in the UK. Now as I'm sure you're aware, we've been doing some pretty daft things over the past few videos with our gem laser. We've driven over one in a Range Rover, we've buried one in the sand and hammered it with a whacker plate, we've frozen one in a block of ice and chiseled it out, we've even put one through a tumble dryer. And my personal favourite was when we dropped it 20 metres from a drone. But of course any of these things would completely invalidate the warranty. So why did we do it? Laser Quantum invests a great deal into the research and development of our lasers to make sure that they are as robust and reliable as they can be with the longest lifetimes on the market. The drop test that you've just seen is performed on every single one of our lasers prior to a 400 hour test that ensures all the components have been securely fitted. Different components react to temperature variations in different ways, both in storage and in use. We need to be certain that any differences in temperature do not adversely affect laser performance. Here we have an environmental chamber where we can take our lasers down to minus 75 degrees C or up to 155. Not all of our lasers are used in laboratory situations. Some are fixed to vehicles as part of mobile operations. Most of our lasers We'll spend time upon delivery to the customer in transportation that is not always as smooth as we would like. To model this, this laser here is currently undergoing 8 to 80 hertz white noise at 5G RMS. All these tests are carried out to make sure that every laser leaving our production facilities maintains an optimum level of performance throughout its entire life cycle, which is backed up by industry leading warranties. If you haven't seen any of our previous videos, Follow this link.